The following is a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru. Hi, I'm Gary Ashburn, and I've been working in the world of collectibles and memorabilia for over 30 years. Here at the Collectibles Guru, we only bring you genuine and exclusive memorabilia from the worlds of sport, music, TV and film, heritage, and even more. Every item we bring you will come with a certificate of authenticity. It'll have our name, our address, our phone number. In other words, you can always contact us. And most important, we're a member of Aftel, who are one of the top three autograph trade associations in the world. This means that every collectible item we bring you is guaranteed 100% genuine. So when we say an item is signed, we guarantee it is hand signed and not a printed or a facsimile signature. So if you're looking for a unique, unusual and highly collectible gift for yourself or for someone you love, then this is the place to be. Hello everybody, welcome to The Collectibles Guru. My name's Ben Mosby and thank you for joining us on what is set to be another fantastic edition. Loads to get through over the course of the next hour and something a little bit different. If you're used to joining us on Sporty Stuff TV, you will know the shows generally are to do with all things sports, but tonight we're turning it on its head and we are all about the music tonight. A one hour music marathon featuring some of the biggest names in the world of music and we've got some amazing items to bring to you over the course of the next hour and uh, taking you all through it uh, the guy sat to my right a, a legend in his own sort of lunchtime uh, it is the one and only collectibles guru it's Kaza Gary Ashburn hey, you're right good to see you. yeah I think so yeah lovely to see you at all looking good oh, right, a new gear. oh you weren't talking to me I thought you were <laughs> <looking good. laughs> yeah you're looking good well, yeah, yeah. new jacket well you know I try I try yeah, uh, very good a bit different tonight isn't it because it's all all music all music yeah normally we do a few pirouettes and a boogie, but I promise not to do that, so don't turn off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we want people to stay with us. Yeah, 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 right, I mean? yeah, yeah. Um, but it is all about, I mean, some really big names within the um, the music industry, from like Elton to Elvis. We've got some um, David Bowie in there as well, mm. and lots of new items. Yeah, a lot of new items, some great new discs. You know, if you love the discs, uh, you should have a look on the website, actually, because we have a whole range of those wonderful discs. They're all a limited edition of 100, but we'll tell you all about them. But uh, yeah, and some great signatures, some amazing items, whatever sort of music you're into i'm sure there'll be something in this show for you absolutely right before we get into it um it is another show where we're going to be giving you the opportunity to save even more money on whatever you're buying we've got that uh, code which is running until april the 8th so if you use the code save at checkout you'll save an extra 10 percent on uh, top of the amazing deals that we're doing this evening and actually it is the last chance uh, this week to use it you've got until this saturday uh, to use that code and bearing in mind it's on everything that we're going to show you on this show but also everything everything on the website as well, collectiblesguru.com. That's where you can do all your shopping this evening. Uh, you've got your clear pay there as well, so you can spread the cost of your shop. Uh, if you want to use the phones, you can do that as well, 0800 254 5402. But a jam-packed show to get through, and uh, Gaza, what are the uh, top of the pops for you tonight? <laughs> well, we've got a few. This lady, always hugely popular, very hard to get now. Wonderful picture, that of Dolly Parton, mounted there, ready to just slip in a frame and hang pride of place in your home. She's always popular, Dolly. And remember, all of these signatures hand signed. New disc, first time we've seen this premiere tonight. This is ABBA, uh, the name of the game, this particular one. Great one, it's our normal style. You've got the uh, platinum disc, and you've got the uh, the photograph of the band, and the uh, and the details, and it's a numbered, all of them numbered, each one, one of a hundred. Then we've got Elton John and uh, Dua Lipa, again, signed by both there. The image of him at the concert, and the two signatures below. So, a wonderful item. And of course, with Elton John now, wounded down his career, mm. very hard to get. Another premiere, we've had lots of requests for this. Yes, it's Lemmy and Motel. Yes. Great item, Ace of Spades. And these are huge, they're 20 by, uh, 24 by 20 in size, that's in inches, big old pieces. There's Kylie Minogue there. Um, Oh, I think she was asking me if I want to go swim or something there, but anyway, <laughs> there she is. Great image of Kylie and the CD and a, a, a genuine hand signed signature. Again, always popular, our Kylie. 
Then we've got the Sex Pistols. This is a special, uh, one of these rare picture discs. We'll show you the sleeve and everything with that later as well. Really collectible, very, very, very rare. And uh, again, I think we just have one of those. Originally, it was a limited edition of 500. We only have one. Eartha Kit, again, only one of these. Great image over there, taking her back to her theatrical days. And she's hand signed an original first day cover from America with her signature. Nice mounted item, ready to slip in a frame, hang on the wall. Bob Marley, always popular. This is one of his greatest, um, takes uh, honors the album Legend. Mm. Same idea, limited edition of only 100, and each one is. Uh, numbered individually and remember we have nowhere near a hundred this one of course blondie again also same idea these are exclusive to this uh, channel at the moment and you won't see these anywhere else but again the one you get will be the only one that exists in the world these look fabulous when you hang them up they really do and then another premiere, this is of course uh, The Jam. This is one of their special albums from many years ago. It's the original double album with the disc and everything uh, from the, the band Snap. And we'll have a look at that later, but that is an old, original, highly collectible double album, wow. Wow, it is an amazing show. And those are just a few of the highlights. We've got some more amazing items to bring to you over the course of this next hour. So hopefully you'll stick with us. As you said, everything you'll be able to see on the website, collectiblesguru.com, uh, and even more items too. I, I'm hoping there'll be something for you tonight, but if not, um, I'm almost guaranteeing there'll be something there for you on the website. But let's dive in uh, with, well, a huge name in the world of music. I mean, it just seems like the nicest woman, not only a, a very talented, uh, singer and actress of course but um, a, a wonderful woman Dolly Parton 370626 uh, for this personally signed photo what an item this is it's a beautiful photograph yeah. of her as well isn't it great photograph and a lovely full signature there uh, signed as I say if you are new to these shows welcome to the family where have you been where have you been oh. <laughs> welcome to the fold um, all of these signatures when we talk about hand signed we guarantee they're held in the hand by the relevant celebrity and personal personally signed. They're not printed, they're not facsimile, and they're not all to pen. And with the uh, paperwork you'll get, it will come with a certificate of authenticity and a lifetime guarantee. The certificate comes from an Aftal dealer, could be myself, or it could be another one, but basically you'll get a certificate of authenticity with it and everything you need to know that it is 100% genuine. Really important when you buy and signed items. But if you want a bit of Dolly, don't hang around, because uh, again, she's always very very popular and that is a beautiful image of her isn't it it is yeah and sign there there I bet go. she was working from nine to five to oh, sign it like that. Oh, no, don't you Sorry. start on the bad <laughs> jokes. But you talk about that song. I mean, obviously, she's, she's done some amazing songs through the years. Obviously, she did um, Islands in the Stream, didn't she? With yeah, Rogers, she was great. She was one yeah. of the top country artists, really. But, but nine to five, you're still hearing that on the radio these you, days. Huge yeah. song, that, wasn't it? Oh, no, massive, massive. Yeah. But she's really, really got a huge following worldwide as well. So, mm. and um, always popular. And a great image for her, really. Really is lovely smile as well absolutely and you know i, I wouldn't want to uh, say how old dolly is um, but she's still looking very very good however old she is <coughs> well uh, my mum always taught me she never ask a lady her age yeah. so i think we'll honor that you know yeah, thanks mum yeah <laughs> <laughs> it is a lovely, lovely item, uh, personally signed by Dolly, and you know, without m making you panic too much, there is only one of those, uh, so it is a case of uh, whoever jumps in nice and early and grabs that gets it. £229.99 is the price there, but you can of course save yourself an extra, what, nearly £23 if you use that code SAVE at checkout. Do use the code, don't forget about it, don't forget to check out and then just ch you know, check out and go, oh no, I've got to use it. Remember it, write it down, SAVE, S-A-V-E, and you'll get an extra 10% off only until this Saturday uh, when that code will cease to exist. 370626, that Dolly Parton personally signed uh, mounted photo display. Next up, a premiere, another premiere for the show. Uh, this is ABBA, name of the game, um, an amazing uh, frame platinum disc and uh, photo display here. Let's just talk about these guys because um, for people perhaps who haven't um, watched this before, won't have seen these, but they're very, very popular, aren't they, these discs? Yeah, these are exclusive. Uh, uh, there were 
exclusively done for TV. Yeah. At this night point now, they are exclusive to Sporty Stuff TV and their associated, you know, agencies. But basically, what you get these are much bigger than the uh, than the normal discs. They're 24 inches by 20 inches, and they're uh, framed. You've got a great. Uh, you've got the platinum disc, and you've got a large photograph of the band and the CD case that comes with it. So it's a wonderful item. There are only a hundred. We don't have anything like a hundred here, and uh, they're, they're numbered individually. So the one you get is the only one that exists. They don't suddenly do another lot. Once they're gone, they're gone. Mm. So you can imagine that only a hundred people in the world can own one of them. An Abra massive. You've got this sort of secondary audience again now, haven't you? As well, what with the recent, you know, with the the you know the Abba um, voyage, voyage Abba voyage, yeah. you know, the uh, sort of well, I'd forgot, hologram. I'd forgotten about that because when we were chatting before the show, obviously there was the Mamma Mia musicals, weren't yeah. there? The two films, and then that was obviously a stage show. But I'd forgotten yeah. that they they'd done this whole show with all of them as holograms. Yeah, it's amazing, Incredible. really. I saw the one they did with Elvis. Was I think the first one they did in the UK. Yeah, and it's. It's just amazing. It's like they're there on the stage. It mm. really is. And I saw one that was done at the uh, the British uh, Festival of Music that was touring around. And they had in in each decade they had a different artist as a hologram doing it. When I walked in, it was Boy George singing, you know, mm. and he was like he was there. Incredible, isn't it's it? It's amazing. But the the Abba one has been a massive runaway success, you know, and they are a huge band and enormous following. I mean, the hits just rattle off, don't they? But certainly, if you know anyone who loves Abba, you've got to think about that for their collection. Yeah, it's framed, ready to hang. And like you said, I think that is going to be something which a lot of people are going to want to snap up because whether you were a fan of them, you know, originally when they were sort of around in the, is the 70s, wasn't it? When they sort of hit uh, mega yeah. stardom, but right through the 80s, 90s, and obviously, you know, recent revivals and stuff. I, I just think they're one of those bands that are almost going to, their music's almost going to live on forever, isn't it? I it is. I mean, it, you know, as soon as it starts playing their sort of music, you get the people, the women and the guys start dancing and boogieing away, didn't they? Mm. But um, they were they were highly talented. And as you say, they just rattled off hits one after the other, you know. Amazing band. And an opportunity to own I mean, something. I mean, a signed item by ABBA these days, if you can get one, oh, yeah. be talking about well over a thousand pounds. I bet. They're very rare. And uh, this is a wonderful piece of ABBA memorabilia. Absolutely. But Great price on it as well. We uh, don't have a lot of those available. So if you like the look of it, 249.99. Uh, the item number is 357457 uh, and again you can save yourself an extra almost £25 tonight if you use that code SAVE off the price you're seeing on screen. Clear pays is £62.50, first of four tonight, uh, whether you are uh, thinking about picking that up or indeed any of the other items that we've got on the show because hopefully, as I said, we've kind of, I think, covered uh, lots of different uh, genres and lots of different eras as well um, and from um, one of the biggest sort of pop bands, I suppose, if you like, to one of the biggest rock bands in uh, Queen this is 392171 uh, again 249.99 and this is the same sort of uh, thing isn't it that amazing um, framed well, gold disc yeah this same story 24 inches by 20 inches big big piece they are exclusive in this format at the moment to, to this channel so you won't see them anywhere else but they are fabulous they look stunning on the wall this one now we're down to the bones on this this is very close to selling out the whole 100 have mm. nearly all gone. We only had a few of them, but we've had 10 here, 20 there. For, but they're, they're virtually down now. I think it's down to almost single figures. So if you want this particular one, Bequeen, it's been one of the most popular, naturally. Yeah. But you do need to move fast if you want to get your hands on one of them. Yeah, and they, they do look the absolute business as well, these, you know, these sort of um, yeah, amazing big frames. You've got that amazing gold disc in there. And again, even the artwork and the fact that you've, you've got these numbered and you, you always sort of point this out, the fact that you know, this is one, uh, one of one or this, isn't it? That's right, yeah. I mean, whoever owns this, this one or whatever number you get, you will always be the only person in the world that has that one. Mm. You know, they are that rare, very, very, very rare. And as I say, when you think of the millions of fans that Queen had, that you're going to be one of 100 people in the world to own one. 
Yeah, you can certainly uh, get one of those tonight, but again, be quick. We've been very, very uh, busy the last few weeks, and uh, again, I know a lot of people uh, like to collect these uh, particular discs. So it's 24 by 20, nice big size, uh, frame gold disc, and that amazing photo display, uh, £249.99, or 62.50 again on ClearPay, 392.171. Now, next item, something a little bit different. Obviously, um, Elton John, huge artist over the years, and Again, he's a guy who's like managed to reinvent himself so many times. Uh, you know, been very, very popular during the 70s, 80s, 90s, 90s, even now. Uh, and I think he's on like the final sort of leg of his sort of farewell tour. Well, yeah, isn't he? world tour. It was split up over a few years because of the problems with like, you know, the COVID, COVID and, and whatnot, the lockdown yeah. and stuff. But it's been, yeah, it's still going on. But I think he's on the latter legs of it now. <clears throat> but proven again. I mean, everybody said you should, you ought to see. Even if you're not a massive fan, you ought to make an effort to see Elton John live because he's just fantastic. Yeah. You know, the way he comes out and just grabs the audience, you know, it, not not literally, but his music does, you know. Yeah. He's just phenomenal. And uh, this is a wonderful opportunity because you've got the picture of him there on stage and you've got the, uh, the, the disc and you've got the two signatures. So a wonderful gift and something really to acknowledge Elton from. Maybe if you weren't lucky enough to get to the gig, you know, <clears throat> if you weren't lucky enough to get to his gigs, you might be able to, you know, look at that and remember. Or maybe if you did go to his gigs, what a wonderful way of remembering that evening out, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Really special. Mm. Hand signed by both of them. Yeah, because, of course, uh, that was a, a big number one. I think the last year or the year before last for Elton and Dua Lipa, they, um, it, was, it was a mashup of a couple of his songs. And uh, that's what I love about Elton, the fact that he's been so um, popular over the years, but then over the last few years, he's teamed up with a lot of um, sort of current artists <laughs> and he's made himself, not that he was never not relevant, but he's, he's very clever with who he kind of teams up with, isn't yeah, he, to keep, keep the legacy going. Yeah. Yeah, he, he's like a lot of these major ones like that. They do seem to be able to have the ability to constantly reinvent themselves mm. and bring them into the current market, don't they? But yeah, great talent. I think Elton John's brilliant. Be sadly missed. But if you know someone who loves Elton John, do have a little think of this. When he con his concerts finish, yeah. he's going to be sadly missed because you won't see him around in gigs. You know? No, I see, and I think I think um, I've told you before. I've seen Elton a couple of times. Once with his uh, full band down in Devon, it was unbelievable at Home Park, and then. Um, a couple of years later he was doing a tour it was just him and his piano pretty much yeah. he played literally two and a half hours solid oh, yeah. him and his piano it was unbelievable one of the greatest really uh, great uh, great pop star great performer as well and this is a really lovely piece that you can grab uh, for just £399.99 uh, this evening clear pay is £100 first of four payments of course and if you want to well, I say if you want to use that code do use that code of save to get almost another £40 off that price 343145 there is just a few of those available so do act quickly if you're a big Elton or indeed a big uh, Dua Lipa fan Right, next up, um, one of these um, amazing uh, discs that we've been showing um, over sort of recent shows that have been very popular. Uh, this is Bon Jovi. Now, this one is the uh, Passing of the Days. Uh, deluxe, um, well, it's a double album, this one, with the blue vinyl. But these are um, very special, aren't they? Yeah, they're, they're basically, Euro well, they call them European exclusives. But, but every one of them, they'd, they'd be, some are 400 of them, one or two are 500, but they're a limited edition of normally 400. They say that less than 150 usually make their way to the UK in total. Mm. You know, so we don't get anywhere near that. We're lucky if we get double figures. Um, but they're very special and they're made as collector's editions. And as you see, a lot, what a lot of them are, in fact, nearly all of them, they're, they're live gigs that appeared on radio stations around the world. Yeah. Yeah. So all the royalties and everything have been met, you know, Then, and so everything's been covered. But then what they've done is produce them in this particular one in various colours, which means people, the fans just snap them up. Yeah. Really, really special. <clears throat> and a lot of people, a lot of people um, actually will frame those and put them on the wall. Mm. And some buy two because then they've got one to play and one to frame up. But, you know, we're not trying to sell you two, but they do fly out the door. And we had a lady, I think only last, you know, they only bought five in one night. Wow, okay. Not unusual. Big fan. It really isn't. There's loads of different ones on the website, but they fly out, literally fly out the door. And once they're gone, they're gone. What we have here of all of these discs that are in on the website at the moment is the final stock. So mm. we can't replenish any of them. 
once they've gone, they're gone. Some we've got one or two left, some we might have nine or 10, but no more, and that's it. Once they're gone, they're gone, but they're very collectible. And as I say, this was a, a live gig again. It will tell you there. Wembley uh, Stadium. Wembley Stadium, this one, was it? Yeah, yeah, 25th of June, 1993. Yeah, and what they normally are, they're copies of radio stations where they have the live gig on the radio station. So yeah. that ties up the rights that they can re remanufacture them and put them out again. But they're very collectible. Vinyl is red hot at the moment. You pay, you'll pay what you're paying for this. You'll pay for a remastered version yeah. that there's hundreds or millions of, you know. So these have really grabbed the attention of them, you know. So I think true fans of the band as well always want to get uh, albums like this, particularly you know, if you weren't at the gig. How nice to be able to hear them performing these songs live. Yeah. Um, so you've got uh, Bad Medicine on there, Better Roses, Keep the Faith. And side two is always Blaze of Glory, Runaway, Wanted Dead or Alive. So you've got some of the biggest Bon Jovi songs on there. And like you said, the, you know, the reason why that lady might have snapped up five or six or whatever it is, was you said, that people might buy one because they want to listen to it, but then they'll buy another one because they want to have it on the wall at the same Frame time. It. Yeah, I mean, it, it is it is a collectible item. You know, it's become very desired. The, the vinyl fans worldwide, although it's a European exclusive, the American market, the Japanese, the Far East, they go mad to get their hands on this because of course they can't normally get them yeah so you've got this the market where they're trying desperately to get their hands on them you've got there's, there's hardly any here anyway so they just become out of stock almost immediately yeah these have been disappearing in a blaze of glory uh, so make yes so make sure you get yours only a handful of these remaining actually uh, 379853 is your item number 59 pounds 99 uh, or 15 pounds on clear pay once again good night to be shopping for these because you'll get to save that extra 10 percent if you use the code save and do check out the website as well because we do have other albums including uh, queen there's tina turner michael jackson uh, depeche mode nirvana uh, there's a whole host of them there if you head to collectibles guru and um, you'll see the full selection but these have been very very popular indeed over the last few weeks whoa well another exciting item to show you right now a brand new item uh, three five three nine two eight uh, if you love a bit of uh, a bit of rock uh, you, you'll love a bit of motorhead and this is brand new tonight isn't it well motorhead were massive I mean Lemmy was a huge character mm. um, I couldn't believe how long it was since he'd left we'd lost him I know yeah shame I mean, he, he was a real character wasn't he you know uh, but again really popular rock band massive felt following and this obviously honors his uh, his legacy really um, a great one it really is this is an actual gold disc this one so the other one well, the other one we saw at Abra earlier was platinum this is a gold version but the same idea 24 by 20 inches big big piece comes complete you've got the gold disc the picture there the 10 by 8 photograph of him performing on stage the cd disc now in this format where yeah. they're not as big this is how the originals are given to the artists oh, of course. and the vip now they're presented like that but i do a lot of charity auctions and these just go mental for these absolutely mm. mental can't go wrong and once again there's only a hundred produced in the whole world we don't any, have anywhere near the hundred but once they're gone that is it we can't get any more so these all of these discs if you see something you want you must dive in quick yeah because otherwise they'll be sold out and you can't get them anymore they, they do look amazing i think i probably said to you before i've worked at mm. various radio stations across the country and um you know now and again it, it, because you're obviously playing all these different songs each and every day the particular song got to number one an artist would send you something similar to this mm. to say oh thank you for all your help for all of the airplay yeah. and we used to display them up and down the corridors in the radio oh, yeah, station they look great they yeah. look the absolute yeah, business they do. don't they well you can have i mean i let i sort of dined off that for for quite a few years on and off you know Attending. people say oh yeah yeah i used to strum a bit like you know <laughs> it was uh, they thought they thought i was like a, an, an aging rock star or something so, imagine me aging rock star yeah. <laughs> Ancient rock, star, ancient maybe. rock star, maybe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just about older guitar. He's done. But anyway, <laughs> but anyway, it, they were great. You know, people loved them, <laughs> and you could convince them. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, did you know? That? Yeah, yeah. Met them loads of times, so you could have lots of fun. Disappear into your Gaza world of fantasy. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> now, that, now, there's a world you wouldn't want to no, no. say. Gaza music wise, music wise, we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if you want to pick this one up, you. 
you'll be one of the very first to get it from us here uh, at Collectibles Guru because it's the first time we've featured it on Sporty Stuff TV. It's the Motorhead, Ace of Spades, I think probably uh, the song that most people uh, will know Lemmy and Motorhead for. It's that 24 by 20 uh, framed gold disc and photo display, limited edition of 100. We do not have 100 of these. We've only got a small amount, so uh, snap that up tonight. 353928. Eight is your item number 62.50 if you're using Clearpay, or if you want to pay outright, it's 249.99. Be less than that, because of course you're going to be using that code, aren't you? Yes, you are. Save uh, to get an extra 10 percent off. Right, a quick break, and you may have heard me mention just then Clearpay. If you're not quite sure what it's all about, here's a video which will make it clear. Spread the cost of your next online purchase with four interest-free instalments when you check out with Clearpay. Simply shop the website at collectiblesguru.com, add your favourite items to your basket, and then select the Clearpay option at the checkout. Log in or create a free Clearpay account for an instant approval decision, and then your purchase will be split into four interest-free payments every two weeks. For more information about using Clearpay, visit collectiblesguru.com. Pay it in four with Clearpay. There you go, hopefully everything is now very clear on that front. Right, if you have just joined us, a very warm welcome. It is Collectibles Guru. Normally, if you're tuning in, you think, oh yeah, it's all sports memorabilia. Not tonight. Uh, it is all about your music memorabilia. And hopefully, we've covered off lots of different genres. Hopefully, um, we've covered your favourite artist or band this evening. But um, whether she's one of your faves or not, you've got to say that this next lady, Kylie Minogue, I mean, again, has been absolutely brilliant. Um, from, I suppose it was the late 80s, wasn't it, where she sort of uh, hit stardom after she came out the back of Neighbours and again she's just stayed very very popular and relevant for the last sort of 30 years. Again she's constantly reinvented herself she always comes across as a really lovely person I was fortunate enough to meet her what many years ago at a charity do and you couldn't wait she was more sweet and more lovely than you ever imagined she's mm. a, be a really lovely person you know and um she she is and her music you know has hit her whole audience but she constantly reinvents it doesn't she she's very clever the way she projects herself mm. and she's just as popular today as she's ever been you know really really popular kylie has a massive following and uh, if you know anyone who loves kylie how about a bit of that hey eh? there she is in her uh, lovely holiday photos you know yeah Can't holiday photos that. well <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> now there she is, a joking apart. Yeah. Great image of Kylie there with the CD disc <laughs> and hand signed by the lady herself. Look at that. Imagine, you know someone who would love that as a special gift. Oh, absolutely. I, t I tell you what, she's just brilliant, isn't she? I used to love her in Neighbours. Well, she was, it was her and Jason Donovan, wasn't it? Yeah, and, uh, God, that was a long time ago. Come out it, the now? back of that, Stock Aitken and Waterman. I should be so lucky and... Yeah. Uh, yeah, she's, she's done brilliant. So many fans of Kylie, uh, I'm sure we'll be wanting to get that uh, particular <laughs> item. 339.99 uh, for the Kylie Minogue personally signed 16 by 12 mounted photo and signed CD display. Uh, 333318 is the item number, 85 pounds on clear pay. Uh, but it'll be less than that because you're going to use that code, of course. Last chance to do it this week before Saturday when it does run out. All right, next up from Kylie to David Bowen. Um, oh. This is another one of these uh, amazing um, photo um, and gold disc displays. And this one is, this is an insane, isn't it? Yeah, this was a very um, intensive period of his music. Again, another person constantly changed his li lifestyle and his music and everything. But we always say Bowie touched the hearts of people's, uh, you know, with his music, with his sexuality, with his, you know, his, his acting, everything really. He, his dance, he was a, just an iconic character. Yeah. But his music was amazing. And uh, this one, Aladdin Sane, was one of the legendary albums of Bowie as soon as a Bowie fan talk about him this one's going to be one of the most talked about albums he ever done so it's the same idea limited edition of a hundred there's only a hundred of them there's nowhere near a hundred left and once these have gone that is it kaput you never see them again you know you might see them crop up in an auction or something but most of these are going to stay on the wall of big fans worldwide they look stunning as you say and once people have got them you don't tend to see them anymore you know they just disappear but they're great items and again you know you put any of these in these charity events they go mad yeah. for them absolutely mad 
I yeah. think I think particularly if you've maybe bought one of these before from from us, um, you know, you you know how good they are because they look great on your TV screen, but they look even better in real life. And once you've got one, I think that then can lead people on to just picking up more and collecting yeah there's these quite a few people Alan my friend down in Clacton on Pond C he's another one who's I wouldn't say surname but he's been building a big collection of these over the years you know I think it's going to be like it's almost he's got Clacton's answer of Abbey Road I think the way he's going <laughs> the amount he's got you know or another record label somewhere else you know but he uh, he's you know that's what happens a lot of people who've got them once they get them they buy more and more and they build a whole collection they look great actually if you've got one of those houses with a big wide staircase and mm. you go up the stairs, they look stunning. You know, mm. sounds posh, yeah. We just about got a staircase where I live. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. And I know what you're thinking. You could do me running up it. Yeah, I do every night, three times. But anyway, <laughs> it's, they're all up the staircase and around. They look fantastic. Yeah. A bit of DIY there for you, you know, from... Uh, Liverpool's answer to the Lawrence Llewellyn Martin. <laughs> and if you're, wa if you're watching Lawrence, I hope life's going well. Because I had oh, the honour of working Lawrence. So. Oh, did you? Yeah, I uh, worked with him briefly. Nice guy, but yeah, anyway. So. Yeah. I'm sure he's tuned in tonight watching. <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah. sure he is. Yeah, a few years ago. Oh, I know him. Yeah. <laughs> no, but like you said, they, they would look great. And I think if, if you've got your own little uh, man cave or your she shed, or maybe you've, you know, you've, you've got your own little studio at, uh, at home, maybe you're a bit of a musician yourself, and I think these are going to look absolutely great great um they're stored around there but you know if you've collected one no doubt you will come back for more this is the david bowie aladdin sane 24 by 20 frame gold disc and photo display uh, limited edition of 100 once again we do not have uh, 100 of these we have just a small amount so think about grabbing yours this evening great night to grab them because normally what 249.99 you can get uh, pretty much 25 pounds off that if you use that code save and it's your last chance to do it because it does end on saturday um so 62.50 is your first payment of four on clear pay uh, we've still got three new items to come over the course of the last uh, 25 minutes or show uh, so on the show and this next one uh, is the first time we have featured this on collectibles guru 328 886 um, sex pistols anarchy in rome so um, tell us a little bit about this 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 is similar to the other ones we saw this is a different company but this is this is a pure one of it's it's an absolute uh, rarity um, and it, it's obvious, as you can see, again, it's a picture disc of Sex Pistols and obviously really sought after. I tell you what, if you had that in Japan, they go absolutely crazy because there's a, a huge following for punk music in mm. the Far East and they go mad, but you just can't get stuff like this. So this is a picture disc of, of uh, as I say, Anarchy in Rome. It shows you the, uh, the, the disc itself. And a lot of these, like the others, these will end up framed, you know. Mm. People will frame that up, hang it, pride of place in the home but very special and if you turn it round, you see the back there as well you've got the uh, the images and things they really are very very desirable and vinyl is massive again at the moment i'm so happy because i've always grew up with vinyl i love vinyl you know and um i just think you know all these when you work out obviously this is these are considered purchase but this one remember this is a brand this is an old original one it's not a revamp one recently or anything it's an old original limited edition uh, you know, picture sleeve with a picture of the. Uh, that yeah, is brilliant, Pope isn't it? The disc yeah. itself looks absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, and again, the legendary broadcast uh, from Rome, 10th of July, uh, 1996, that one says. But some, um, yeah, amazing, amazing um, items. Uh, amazing item. And just the disc itself just looks. The business, doesn't it? It is. It's, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, pr presumably everything about the Sex Pistols and that period and the music was always quite controversial, but that is a true collector's item for it, whatever you're into with music, love them or hate them, that is a true piece of punk uh, memorabilia. And again, we just have the one of those, so you'd have to get there really quickly, you know? Really, really quickly. Guys, look at that. Out, there they are, right look. There. Anarchy in Rome. I hey? tell you what, it's anarchy on the show tonight as yeah. well. Oh. <laughs> Terrible. Is, You'll only... end up in the Tower of London. It was nice, <laughs> nice knowing you all. Yeah. <laughs> uh, there's, up... <laughs> there's only one available. <laughs> this uh, particular item. I'm sorry. Uh, 328 is your item number uh, for the uh, Sex Pistols Anarchy in Rome. And it is a 
as I say, anarchy in the studios tonight. Uh, 69.99 is the price on that, or four clear pay payments. Uh, three, two, eight, double, eight, six. All right, uh, a new item from Earth Kit coming up in just a few moments' time. Uh, but back to one of again the most popular items that we do on these music memorabilia shows. Um, these amazing um, disc displays, and this one is a platinum Elvis display. This one, isn't it? Yeah, this is Elvis at Sun Records. This is proven really popular. Uh, I think you said a few weeks back, we are down now to the bare bones on these single figures. Mm. Once they're gone, that's it. Elvis is, is, a, is an institution, as we all know, you know, but very, very few of these left. As I say, single figures, great image of him. And of course, this takes you back. Uh, Sun Records was probably one of the most influential and respected periods of Elvis's life. Mm. Sun Records are legendary worldwide anyway. So and that th this really is a piece of the heart of Elvis. Great image of him there in his sultry best, eh? Oh, oh thank you for that, was that? And then a the great image of him. Yes. And again, any Elvis fan would love this. We do have some other versions of Elvis, if you're quick as well. So have a little look on the website, www.collectiblesguru.com. They're constantly changing, but we are the only source where you'll see these available. Uh, you might see an odd one offered in an auction environment or somewhere else, but generally, we we're the only people with these all these discs in this format are exclusive to this channel mm. so you won't see them anywhere else in this format so do have a little look at that but again only there was a hundred originally the one you get will be numbered but once they're gone that is it no more and i think particularly elvis i mean always popular but with the uh, the movie which was out of course last year and that's been up for various mm. awards with it being award season i think you know, younger people perhaps who knew maybe a little bit of Elvis are now getting into him they'll watch the movie then they'll start listening to the music and then that will then you know become like a love for them and then they'll be looking to pick up items yeah. like this won't they well my other half a little nephew he, he is I think is he nine now he went to see the Elvis movie you know and he's now like an Elvis freak he loves oh, Elvis he's gone so mad look, look it's going. great isn't it <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah I've been teaching him yeah. I, trouble is well, I, have I, get, quiff. I have to get the stick on, stick on quiff in my case <laughs> got to be careful you say that this time night, <laughs> you do you, know? you nearly said it wrong yeah. where's my stick on quiff <laughs> anyway sorry won't go there again <laughs> look at that but again an Elvis fan look at that wonderful wonderful item yeah. put a smile on the face of someone you love with a little bit of Elvis P uh, three, Are four, you? six, seven, one, four. Uh, Elvis Presley, that's the Sun Records 24 by 20 frame, platinum disc and photo display, uh, limited to 100. Again, we don't have all 100 of those. You have to be quick if you want to grab that this evening. Three, four, six, one, seven, four, uh, 249, 99, or use ClearPay and certainly use that code as well to get yourself that extra 10% off. The code is SAVE. Brand new uh, to us this evening here on uh, Collectibles Guru, and indeed, uh, brand new just one uh, of the amazing Eartha kit. This is 398886 um, for this. Oh, wow, I love the signature. Yeah, it's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, it's a great image of it. It comes mounted photograph with this, uh, what again is a, an original first day cover mm. from America. I think that's Duke Ellington, it is, isn't I think it? it is, yeah. yeah. Uh, so you've got a photograph there, and then underneath is a first day cover with a, a genuine American postage stamp of Duke Ellington. And I believe Eartha Kitt, coming in back, obviously used to do some singing around there with that period. I don't know, if she, I think she might have been with. I don't know whether I'm right on that, but she was around that period. But I suspect that may well be the link, you know, my knowledge of jazz is not so good, but Eartha Kit, brilliant, hand sign there. And you've got the added advantage because it's a music related cover, yeah. which again makes it much more interesting and desirable for an Eartha fan or a music fan. I see. I, I, Santa Baby was one of her um, her songs originally, wasn't was it? it? A Christmas song, Santa Baby. Yeah, and yeah. of course, she was... Um, I don't think she was the original, but she was certainly in, in the original series of uh, Batman as well. Yeah, she, played, she was. She played Catwoman, didn't she? Yeah, she did, yeah. yeah. She was, I remember her, she used to do quite a lot of chat shows at, at one point. She was always very interested on the chat shows. I was going to say, she was a bit of a character, wasn't yeah, she? Yeah, she was. I think that's a good way of putting it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Diplomatic way of putting it, anyway, yeah. Um, you would say she was quite a handful as a character. It means that, you know, you had to sort of... Um, 
I think she was a bit sort of flaky in the way she was. You'd be frightened, I think, if you had her on your chat. Yeah. So what she right. was going to do. Really, really good fun. And uh, as you say, done a lot of different acting work as well. So really respected. I remember the song, Where Is My Man? Where's My Man? Do you remember that? No, how does that oh, go? I'm not Oh, shall I sing it? <laughs> no, don't. Uh, no, don't. <laughs> I'll harm it. Oh, no, man, I have a man. Where is my baby? Something like that. Oh, was, that one. That Remember one. it? No. Never heard it before. No, no, no clue. Sorry, that was interference there. I don't know where that came <laughs> from. Sorry. But no, it, again, it is a super piece. And, and what I love about this, once again, is the fact, and it seems to be, like every time you say it, it seems to be like the, uh, the kind of further back in time you go, the clearer the signatures are. And, and it's a good point of touching on that because you can, you can clearly see that that is Eartha Kitt's signature. It looks uh, it, just like it. Um, and and it, well, the reason I say this is because sometimes it's hard to decipher, isn't it? But that is as clear as day, Eartha Kit. Yeah. But also, we can guarantee that that is Eartha Kit, and that's one of the reasons people buy with you, isn't it? Well, that's right. Every one of these, remember, every one of these signed items comes with a certificate of authenticity from myself or another AFTEL, UACC or PDSA in America. They're official autograph recognised dealerships. They're the people, the police, the trading standards, the insurance companies, the auction houses. They go to those societies for verifying autographs as genuine. So when you're dealing with us, you, you're getting the very best provenance and authentication that you can. Mm. So you can buy confident in the knowledge that these are all real. Yep, and that is uh, one of one. We've only got that one available. So uh, if you fancy snapping that up, do be quick. It's £189.99, for the Eartha Kit. Personally signed 16 by 12 mounted photo and signature display. Uh, but of course, again, you can save yourself 10% by using the code SAVE, S-A-V-E. That code is only valid until Saturday. That will be your last chance to use it. And worth bearing in mind, again, in case I haven't mentioned in the show, you can use that right across the website as as well so obviously on items on this show but then right across the website as well which is collectiblesguru.com and if you've not yet had chance to have a look at the website or know too much about it let's explain some more welcome to collectiblesguru.com your trusted source for genuine collectibles and memorabilia here you can shop by category to browse hundreds of items from the world of sport tv and film music heritage and our selection of gift ideas if you're looking for something more specific, why not browse our most popular subcategories, including boxing, football, Hollywood greats, royalty, and Star Wars. Or if you've seen something you like on TV, just search the item number here to find out more details and to add to your basket. Plus, when you shop online, you have the option to spread the cost of your order with four interest-free installments when you select the clear pay option at the checkout. Now, if you want to find out why you can trust Collectibles Guru, then read our authenticity guarantee, including Gaza's top tips for when it comes to buying items of memorabilia. And if you've missed any of our fabulous shows, just click the TV catch-up page and you can watch us on demand. So log on to collectiblesguru.com, where the world of collectibles and memorabilia is only a click away. There you go. Lots of to come in the final quarter of an hour. Going to be featuring Blondie. We've got the Jam, John Lennon on the way, the Stones. Uh, but next up, huge, huge band, uh, Pink Floyd, going to be featuring right now um, item number 379044. And uh, this is another one of those amazing frame platinum discs. And, and this probably, well, their biggest album, Dark Side of the Moon. Yeah, th this has been one of the biggest sellers in this range. Pink Floyd are obviously massive, one mm. of the biggest rock bands in the world ever. You know, they really are massive. And this one, once again, there's less than 20 of these left in total now. And um, that's in the world, the whole world. Yeah, know? yeah. So you remember, you can't buy these anywhere else, nowhere else. So these are, again, Pink Floyd friends, you know, have tried to grab these from all over the world. But they are all, you know, these are very hard to get, but they look stunning. And as you said earlier, you hang them on the wall and they're definitely going to want a lot more. They're great. And people who have, you know, maybe like a bar or a restaurant, a hotel, a media business, these look brilliant on the wall. They really do turn heads. As you said, 
said, your radio station. Yeah. Everybody stops to read them, doesn't Exactly they? right. We had them up and up and down the uh, the corridor outside of the studios. And, yeah, we had some amazing uh, discs that were sent and just great talking points. You know, whenever you were showing guests around the station, you could tell everyone about them. Mm. I, I just love your idea of just getting a load of these and, and winding mates up, going, oh, oh yeah, 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 you know. That's right. But, yeah, big, 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 big friend of the band, you know. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Do you not know? God, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I uh, strum a bit myself, you know. Yeah, you know, yeah. Used to play for them a little bit back in the day, kind yeah. of thing. They normally put me on at last orders, but anyway. <laughs> yeah, no. when they wanted everyone to go home. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Get them out. Uh, this one again, though, like Gaz is saying, um, limited edition. We, we don't have, I know it says limited edition of 100. That's how many of these uh, were made. We don't have 100 of these. If you if you want to get one, uh, snap one up quickly because they are proving popular. 379044 <laughs> is the dark side of the moon. £62.50 is your first payment of four on Clearpay. Use that code, of course, and you'll get an extra 10% off. All right, next up from Pink Floyd to another big, big uh, band in the form of the Rolling Stones. And I want to say, I don't think I've, or maybe I have seen this one before. Or, ha or have I? I don't know if we have. Yeah, we, you we have, have. Yeah, we you have. have seen it, yeah. Yeah, R Rolling Stones, black and blue. It, it's, it's a great, uh, the reason I like this particular one, it's got a good image of the band, which okay, yeah. a lot of people like, you know. Mm. But uh, yeah, the Stones, so many albums, and this one obviously is a platinum version. Mm. Same idea, limited edition of 100, only 100 in the entire world. Really proven, so popular, these discs. And again, if you know one of, you know, a big mate or somebody who appreciates the Rolling Stones, they make fantastic gifts, especially for that really big occasion, you know, yeah. maybe holiday, honeymoon, or whatever. Someone said to me, how about divorce? Divorce. A divorce? Or <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> to celebrate, celebrate a divorce, or yeah. to, to give it to someone before uh, you get yeah, divorced. Yeah, I think my other half that, that she'd probably buy a collection. <laughs> 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 He's gone, I've got him in the bed! Something like that. You love me, really. Yes, anyway, he does. Uh, and um, but these are great. You know, they really are fantastic. And as I say, you, you know, you, the perception of these. You know, you go to charity auctions, and I'm, I'm not hyping them up. You know, I can tell you when and where they they go for sometimes four figures. You know, they really do. People love them. I've actually stood up and said, look, this is not. The, do you understand? This is not the original. You know, disc because that would probably be a hundred thousand pounds. Mm. But it is a replica of what was done or blah 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 and they go oh, okay but then they they love them you know you get one or two people who've had a couple of uh, a bit of an evening out and a couple of soft drinks too many you know and the price they start bidding the prices go mad for some of them mm. but apart from that obviously just buy them because you love them or if you know anyone who loves any of these bands or the artists they do make fabulous gifts and remember whoever they get it for or whoever you buy it for there's only a hundred of the entire run in the world world yeah and worth again if you do like the idea of these maybe you've bought one previously uh and you know maybe the stones isn't your band do check collectiblesguru.com because we we do have uh lots of different bands featuring on these disc and photo displays so you know if the stones isn't a, a particular favorite of yours hopefully you will find your uh, favorite band or favorite artist on the website and that's why i think the best place to order is collectiblesguru.com um loads you can have a look at there have a little peruse see what else we've got um, and of course you can spread your cost over for interest-free payments with Clearpay. You can, of course, phone us if you just want to get on the old uh, dog and bone. 0800 254 5402 is the phone number um, to get in touch. And as we said, tonight, all about the music. We're featuring lots of different items. Normally sports on these shows, of course, but if you go over to the website, you'll find sports, you'll find music, you'll find film, you'll find TV, and you'll find a whole host more. So it is worth having a little bit of a look and things changing at the website all the time. Uh, but if you love that Rolling Stones item, 354209. Covered a lot of uh, rock and pop over the course of this show. So uh, even things out, I think, maybe with a bit of uh, reggae. When you, when you hear that word reggae, you think reggae music. No one bigger than, uh, than Bob Marley, really, no, was there? No. Well, he, he really took reggae music into a some people say a more commercial fold yeah but he i think what he really did he maybe did but he actually took uh, reggae music into a broader market a much broader market of people that began to appreciate it who perhaps hadn't done in the past mm. he was a highly talented musician you know and um, again one of those who sadly passed away far oh, too far young, too young. He's in his but, 20s, uh, I think, wasn't yeah he? he was an amazing talent mm. you know and this is your opportunity to honor you know probably one of reggae's well 
possibly, if not the biggest, certainly one of their biggest names ever to come out of the world of reggae. Yeah, and again, this one is, is similar, isn't it? So this is a gold disc this time, uh, but once again, a limited edition item, isn't it? That's right, a limited edition of only 100, so each one's numbered individually. So whichever, you know, if you get one of these, you will be the only one with that number in the entire universe, you know. So really special. They are great items. And as I say, when you hang them on the wall, they really, really do turn heads. Yeah, three, four, eight, nine, four, nine. Uh, Bob Marley's legend, um, 24 by 20 framed gold disc and photo display, uh, £249.99. And again, four clear pay payments of just 62 50 uh, for that one. Item number is 348949. Oh, we've got some amazing artists on the show tonight. And you know, talking about um, artists who are taken far too soon, uh, John Lennon, another of those. Um, 3883216 is the item number for. Um, imagine, and again, I mean, he obviously had many hits with the Beatles, but uh, many yeah. big hits o on his own after the, after the Beatles. Uh, Another up. amazingly talented, you know, guy. Mm. As I've said, people may have heard me say it in other in the past, other mm. shows. I remember I announced on the radio how he'd died, and I was like, wow, I just couldn't believe it. Yeah, I actually felt quite guilty because only a week before, one of my relatives had died, who a bit more distant mm. and. And I actually, I felt I didn't cry when they died. But, but when Lennon, I was like in pools of tears. But I think it was because I grew up with him. I always sort of seemed, I never knew him. Yeah. But I had that visionary that I knew him and felt part of him, you know. And so it was quite, it hit me hard when he died. I couldn't believe it. Mm. And the circumstances, how he went out and, you know, it, it all happened on the way back. And it was pretty awful and grim. But because uh, he was just living a normal life, you know, going out for a coffee and a you know, something to eat with his wife in a, living a very in-your-face life. Mm. You know, he was there in New York. You know, you would see him regularly coming out the building, you know, where he lived, the Dakota building. It's well known, you know, and it wasn't difficult. He didn't hide away. He lived a normal life, just like somebody drifting in and out of the crowd. Mm. And when he, that snatched away from him, so talented, I was gutted, you know, really. But he was an amazing musician. And again, one of them taken far, far too young. Yeah, it's a lovely piece once again and uh, limited to 100. Once again, we have got um, just a handful of those. Uh, 383216 is your uh, ISIM number for that one, 249.99. And again, I think that that will be another popular one. You know, Beatles always very popular. And I think you know, certainly since uh, it was, what's that movie called? Yesterday, isn't it? Have you seen mm. that? Such a great movie yeah. where th there's the young lad who um, takes all of the Beatles music, doesn't he? Because the Beatles cease to exist in this particular film but there's a, there's a great part towards the end of the film where he goes and searches for John Lennon and it's uh, Robert Carlyle who plays the part of John Lennon and he's, he plays him absolutely brilliantly. Uh, um, so if you're a big fan of, of John Lennon and the Beatles and you haven't seen that movie yet, do make sure you check it out. It's very, very good. And if you are a John Lennon uh, Beatles fan, then no doubt this will be high on your list of items to snap up. It's a great night to buy it tonight as well because you know we, we normally bring these to you at 249.99. We don't always have 10% uh, off code so it's, it's a great opportunity if you if you had your eye on this one uh, tonight is a great way to go because you can save yourself nigh on 25 pounds off the price that you're seeing on screen use clear pay as well uh, and hopefully that makes that amazing item uh, a little bit more affordable for you so uh, John Lennon 383216 we've also got on the show this evening uh, Blondie um, and this is uh, Parallel Lines yeah another great album and a really big Band with well, band with a huge cult following. You know, mm. Debbie, Harry, and Blondie, hits after hits. You know, really talented and still almost as popular as they were at the peak of their success. Yeah, you know? and Debbie Harry still going on stage singing, doing a bit. They are really popular, Blondie. And again, if you know somebody who's you know who really adores Blondie, you couldn't have a better gift. You know, I know there's many people who adore Debbie Harry as well. You know? Oh, absolutely. And yes. she's still performing from time to time. Oh, is she really? She, yeah, I understand she's still performing from time to time. Yeah. So, you know, good luck to her. You 
know. Good old rock chick, eh? That's it. Good old rock chick. Uh, not Three. old, sorry. <laughs> no. Young rock Good chick. Good young rock Do chick. Do apologise, Debbie. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they're all watching tonight, aren't they? I'm sure. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah Debbie, will be, Debbie will be watching. Uh, 317299. That is Blondie. Parallel lines. It's your 24 by 20 frame platinum disc and photo display. 317299. Uh, and that price again, 249.99. And clear pay available for you too. Uh, two amazing items, well, three actually, to wrap up the show. I mean, we've saved one of the best till last. Uh, but this next item is just brilliant. And first time you'll have seen it here on the show, there is one of these, uh, very rare. Uh, this is the Jam and uh, Snap double album. Yeah, it's, as you say, double album. Now, this don't confuse this with the remastered. This is one of the originally produced, original produced versions of this album it's a double album it's highly collectible maybe if you would maybe you can pick that up and have yeah. a look in a minute because uh, you can show inside it's like a biography of mm. the band on the inside of the sleeves so maybe we'll have a look at that in a minute but it is absolutely fantastic fantastic images it to me it's vinyl at its best ever and of course this was one of this were one of paul weller's first bands you know when he started off and yeah they really are it's a great album remember this is the original album in very good condition it'll have a few marks because it's an antique but um it's a wonderful wonderful album and if you've got a jam fan look at that yeah, so it's like a full-on um, almost history, isn't it? Yeah, you, you'd be paying that virtually for a remastered version if you could get one. Yeah, but this this is really a great item, and any any sort of fan of uh, you know of as I say of the jam would love an item like that. And Paul Weller, of course, because uh, now known as the Mod Father, his nickname, isn't it? Yes. He uh, and then he you know he was what was he? He was in um, so many bands with his Style Council and of things. Of course, yeah. Style got, Council. He, he's got a huge huge following in his own right and uh, there they are the original band there it, absolutely superb and um, any fan of jam would cherish that that is a piece of music history yeah and just reading off the bat there as well um the songs on well it's, well, it's, it's a double album isn't it so you've got in the city away from the numbers you've got modern world eating rifles on there going underground um, what else is on there? Butterfly Collector, Absolute Beginners. I mean, there's tons and tons of songs on there. Like, like mm. you say, it's a beautiful album. And just to reiterate again, an, an original. Uh, yeah, original this is an copy. original. This is not, not a reproduction or a remastered version. This is an original album in very good condition uh, of the period. And um, uh, as I say, double album. And it's a piece of true, true, again, you know, sort of. Uh, memorabilia music memorabilia of the period a great album and an original which is in absolutely superb condition and like you say for the fact that it's an original that i've just uh, clocked the price on screen that is incredible 69.99 mm. when you consider like what what um kind of re re-editions are being that's right some of these remastered the versions yeah. are anywhere between 35 45 55 15, yeah. pounds you're paying that you know that price there for something that's what 30 years old yeah. plus yeah you know and very very rare you know very special that is if you're a vinyl collector or you love or appreciate vinyl which many of you do now you probably heard me talk recently about going to a, a record fair it's full of youngsters you know reinventing it with the vinyl you grab it if you love a bit of jam get that quick get it quick that will go we've got one three nine one eight seven six sixty nine ninety nine save yourself almost seven pounds if you use that code uh, uh save to get ten percent off the four payments on clear pay is 1750 less your 10 percent uh just to finish before we uh bring you the uh, official collectibles guru mug which i know you've all been waiting for uh this next item is absolutely brilliant if you're a fan of the foo fighters uh, their bass guitarist nate mendel uh, has well signed the guitar mm. This, uh, obviously we don't have the full size guitar in the studio because it's like a museum piece. You get a mark on it, it's damaged, it's wrecked. So yeah. this is not here, but it is a full size guitar, hand signed by Nate Mendel. And again, as you know, Foo Fighters are again a hot, hot band at the moment, mm. huge following. And uh, it's your chance to grab a piece of music history. These guitars often, 
are snapped up big time in auctions and things. The fans love them. So, you know, you can't go wrong with that. And the Foo Fighters have had so many hits themselves, haven't they, really? Yeah. You've got Dave Grohl, who was in that, wasn't he? He was in Nirvana. In Nirvana, it's yeah. in Nirvana. In and it, uh, a great item. But again, obviously it's a considered purchase, but what you're buying is a real piece of music history. Yeah, it is, and it's uh, sorry, 1,299.99, but again, if you've had your eye on that, maybe you spied it previously on the website. Tonight, of course, you can use that code uh, SAVE and get 10% off that, so hopefully, again, making that more affordable for you, but if you love it, please grab it. Nate Mendel personally signed that from the Foo Fighters. 373146 is your item number. And finishing off the show this evening, the item I know you've all been waiting for, it's the, the item <laughs> everyone's talking about, it's the item everyone goes to the Collectibles Guru website for, it's the mug. Yeah, looking at me when you said that. Yeah, <laughs> nice, isn't it? Called a mug, yeah. Right. But you got this done because a lot of people saw it on the set, didn't they? And they like the look of it. We had loads of requests for it and our lovely director, Daniel, there, went out and uh, managed to... Uh, pluck some from the thousands that were headed all around the world, you know, sort of, uh, you know. Um, no, I'm winding you up, I'm kidding, sorry. I'm kidding you. But no, seriously, a lot of people asked if they could get one of these mugs, and we said, yeah, we'll try and get you some. And they've proven very, very, very popular. I've even had two people ask if they'll sign them. But, oh, dear. Uh, uh, yeah, they must have been. <laughs> but uh, no, seriously, if you want something to remind you of the shows, which hope you enjoy, if you do enjoy them, tell us. If you don't, tell us, and we'll try and make them more interesting for you. Yeah. <laughs> Any requests, anything, do let us know, because we love hearing from you. That's it. Uh, studio CollectiblesGuru.com. If you like the show, tell me. If you don't like the show, tell him, for goodness sake. <laughs> uh, but listen, talking about the show, time is almost up. Thank you again for a brilliant show, Cheers, sir. Mate. Good to see you. Yeah. See you. Uh, and well done to uh, everyone who's managed to get their hands on any of those items tonight. If you've got your eye on any of them and you haven't yet done it, head to the website or give us a call and we will be back with you very soon here on Collectibles Guru. Until then, bye for now. You've been watching a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru.